Look at these. Where's that felt? Inside, but don't get mad at her. She's very sad. Away. Listen, she's sad, Mukadis. Yeah, she won't stop crying. She doesn't want to get married. So she won't marry, then what? Huh? She going to be the whore of the town? Don't say that. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. And what will she do? How else can she shut them up? I will protect her. You stop it now. No one can say anything. No one can do you anything. shut up. <sighs> Mustafa's angry and he burned the house down. Now he's gone crazy. He attacked me right in front of the police. He almost killed me. And you still think you can protect her? Well, you're stupid. Hello, Uncle. What? Oh, that's just great. Well, okay, I'll fix it. Okay, I'm on it. I'm on it. Got it. What happened? You look at me, stupid girl, huh? You'll do what we say. You'll do everything I say. And if I tell you to, you'll get married. Stop it. Stop, stop. The police have just called Karen. <gasps> Now you will give evidence if I have to make you. You will tell the police what I told you to say. Do you understand me? Don't yell at my sister! Stop it! Stop it! We don't have time. Quickly! If you don't fall in line, you'll be responsible for the rest. And that's it for me. You have to get it together. And what happened to your hand? She... She cut her wrist and she wanted to kill herself. Oh, you're kidding. Well, it's not too deep. Don't worry. It's just a little scrape. First you bring all this trouble, and now you're trying to kill yourself? Shame on you! Leave her alone, Mukherjee. She's very upset. Fatmagul, Fatmagul, you must listen to me. Now, you don't have a chance with Mustafa. He wiped you out. He left you and burned everything. All he's thinking is revenge, and you know he hates you. Don't say that! Just stop! If you loved him, you wouldn't do this. If he kills you, he'll be in prison. And have you thought about your brother here, huh? You listen. <sighs> Shouldn't he walk with his head held high? Have you thought about that? Listen, do you hear what he's saying to you? And, and you know that everyone's at your door because this is fun for them. They wonder what's going on and everyone's talking. You know that they can't live here anymore with this dishonor. Get that through your head. Where are you going? Uh, come back. She's gone crazy, come here. Halide sent us to you. And please don't kill the messenger. Halide told Fat Magul what she thinks about this. But they wanted to tell you that the engagement is now over. We brought this bundle of your engagement things and your gifts. How great for Halide! And how great for Emin too. And also Mustafa. This is excellent timing. What a shame. We're dealing with our sorrow, yet they send the stupid bundle, not even asking how we are. They should be ashamed for their lack of humanity. Here, take your belongings. Give it, take it, right? What do they expect from us right now? Give it back to them, quick. They weren't ashamed to give us this thin, cheap little bracelet. Now you give me that ring. Stop. Like that tiny ring is worth anything. Too. So they'll have it all. No, Halide said not the bundle. They just wanted us to bring back the ring, and that's all. Ah! Like she needs the ring. Show's over. Everyone get going, all right? Go on. Shall I go get Murad? He is still playing with my son now. I'll come get him later. All right. <laughs> Don't cry, please. Please stop the crying, Fatmagul. Don't you cry. Do you see what we've become? From now on, this is how you're going to be treated. You've got only one option, Fatmagul. 
I think you see now that you need to marry. <laughs>